Before I proceed to part two, I think I should clarify and, and correct a few things from part one. So I'm going to call this part one A. Maybe I should call it B. <laughs> but I'm going to call it part one A. First off, in part one, I said I did not know if Irish 282 knew he was taking on Encyclopedia Dramatica when he made the fight his own video. He says no, he did not. Which makes perfect sense to me. Because when I first was attacked by the Alway clan, I didn't have a clue. I think it was three weeks before I ever heard of the Alway clan. And then I don't think I realized that there was a YouTube group called YTYC at least until October, maybe not even until November. Second thing is I should correct the statement that the suicide incident that I referred to was the precipitating event for the stalking of Violet Kitty 411 and Circa Rigel. It was already ongoing, but that just added fuel to the fire. So I was somewhat mistaken there. It was, however, an event that precipitated even more vicious stalking at a higher level particularly of Circa Rigel, which led to the involvement of Irish 282, as I showed you in the video. Now, Rue, also currently Matisse Maximum, of course denies my version of the story, and although I still can't give you any documentation relevant to that particular story, I can show you a specific incident involving Rue as the devil in heels, telling someone to commit suicide. So that there is precedent for this. You also note that in this uh, exchange, if you follow the link that I'm going to give you, that Kitty, who we'll get to in another video, also joined in as a member of the Alway clan in harassing this person. That letter, supposedly written by VK, the one that's a fake, I want to show you a screenshot of that. You'll note that it originates from a Jamie Demeter. I believe Jamie Demeter is found in all versions. This is just one version. Sometimes it's forwarded, forwarded, forwarded. Depends on where you locate it on the net, and it's in numerous places. Now, Jamie Demeter is a well-documented alias, email alias, a sub-7 from the Yahweh clan. So, there you go. Also, you'll note the uh, spelling error, which would be very atypical of Violet Kitty, but very typical of sub-7. And you'll note that on this particular form, the person who put it up, uh, basically calls it bullshit, which it is. The last thing I want to say is that these videos are in no way intended to be a defense of Irish 282. Irish 282 can defend himself as he wishes or not. Inasmuch as these videos are exculpatory of Irish 282, that's purely a happenstance of fact. My purpose is to document the creation and, later on, other aspects of the YouTube Yahweh clan. And that's all. You will not hear me say Irish to A2 is not a pedophile. You will not hear me say that about anyone. Because I can't say that about anyone. And neither can anyone else. The only one about whom I, or anyone else, could say that truthfully under oath, as it were, would be myself. I can say, under oath, I'm not a pedophile. I cannot say that about any other living human being. I do not know. What I can say about other people is either there is evidence that tells me there is a probability or a possibility or even a certainty that they are a pedophile, or there is no such evidence. 
or the evidence is inconclusive. Anyway, um, I'm not sure when part two will be out. I've got a lot of work to do on editing and shooting and screen capping and what have you. So please be patient and stay tuned.